What is up guys? It is that time for the next gen console launch. And as you can see, I got mine right here. Let's open this bad boy up. What did I get today though? Let's see, I got the Spider-Man Miles Morales, Morales launch edition. I don't know what launch edition means, but there's some, uh, some suits in here. So there's some free DLC. I like it. I really like the uh, Spider-Man game before this. It's really good. I got a second controller. I'm not gonna open this because there's one in the uh, the box here. But of course, you can't play two-player couch co-op stuff without another controller. So I got that. And of course, PlayStation 5. This thing is heavy. This is a very big box, as you guys can see there. This is this is huge. This is actually the biggest, uh, probably the biggest box I've seen on a console in a while, maybe ever. Let's pull this bad boy out and see what we got going here, though. And yes, I am going to save the box because, well, it's just what I do. Okay, let's see. Pretty excited about this. I wasn't really excited about it until, like, just now, honestly. I really feel, I really feel like, can I get this out? I really feel like we could have ran current gen of consoles another couple of years, truthfully. Um, but that's just me. Alright, get out of here. Okay, here we go. We got the actual console here. Oh, alright, let's do this. Be careful, I don't want to drop this. Ooh, damn, this thing is big. Here we go. Uh, we do got the, I did get the one with the disk drive, as you can see right here, obviously. Uh, that's how Jay rolls. I prefer physical media over downloaded stuff. Um, from what I hear, Bug Snacks is supposed to be free if you got PSN, which I do. So I'm going to get this thing hooked in, plugged in in a minute. Uh, much like there's going to be an update. I assume there's going to be an update. And uh, uh, yeah, we're going to. We're gonna get this thing going. This thing is, this thing is enormous. Look, this thing is huge. So what do we got back here? Uh, back in the back, got your standard stuff, power cord, um, obviously slot. You got your, we can do an ethernet cable here. Uh, what else is back here? Oh, a couple of USBs. And then of course your HDMI. Got a couple of USB ports back here on the front. Uh, we've got a USB port and I would assume that that's probably something else, a charging cable port maybe. I don't know if uh, the charging cable for the controller is going to have USB or not. And then you got your eject button and your power button uh, right underneath the disk drive slot there. Uh, so let's see what else came in this guy. Uh, crazy, crazy. I feel like, I feel like Billy Madison when it was Nudie Magazine Day. Uh, power cord, obviously you need that. Um, okay, here's your, here's your charging cable for your uh, controller, USB on one end, and this obviously goes into the controller. Um, I don't know what the ends are called on these, but uh, it's an end. I don't know. Okay, let's open that. See how this is gonna, how it's gonna fit. Is that about a four foot cord? Four foot cord? It's not, that's, eh, it's not great. I wish they'd start putting at least six footers in here. 10 would be nice, but you know, what are you gonna do? 
And here's the controller. Ooh. Oh, this thing. Shut up, phone. Sorry, let me get rid of you for a minute there. This thing feels nice, I'm not gonna lie. It's very it's very comfortable. It's kind of like a you know what? That's a little little stormtrooper colorway going right there. Oh, the buttons are clear. Let me here, let me let me show you guys. Check it out. Buttons are clear on there. That's kind of dope. I like that. I like it. Oh yes. And I guess plug into the top. That way you can. Uh, uh, oh, 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 oh! Check it. Check it out. We do got headphone jack down here on the bottom, which is swell. I prefer a corded headphone. That way, I ain't got to worry about batteries and it going dead and whatnot. Very neat. PS button, um, that's different this gen console. It's usually round, it's just the button, the outline of uh, the PlayStation logo. I'll show you guys that up close as well. Right there, sorry, I get a little close, gets a little dark, there it is. Button here in the middle, kind of like a PlayStation 4 controller, um, you got the what is that? Oh, okay, um, a mute button for your microphone right there if you don't have it on your microphone or on your headphone, sorry. Um, standard controller, let's see if there's any big differences in the design. Little bit, little bit. Cripes. So there we go. It's a little bit different, it's a little bit bigger, uh, a little bit taller. About the same width. They actually narrowed the uh, handles here, which I thought these were just a little bit too fat from the uh, you know PS3 uh, design. So they narrowed them down just a little bit. Let me see here. That's that's, that's pretty comfortable in the hand. It's pretty comfortable in the hand. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like it. I like it. Okay, it's not bad, it's not bad. Um, let's we'll see what else is in here. We got our handbooks, startup guide books and whatnot, and, oh, HDMI. And this is something I will be using, actually, because I prefer my consoles to lay down flat instead of stand up. This is the stand so that's uh I'll figure that one out in a minute i'll figure oh just turn it there it goes so this back opens up right here and you've got uh some sort of uh, yeah, the screw to go from here into the console underneath and it's going to allow you to lay your console flat so it'd be like I got such a mess going over here right now. Oh, because you can see this isn't exactly flush, if you will. So this is actually gonna rest like this, but I'll figure all that out in just a minute. Um, I don't know why so heed this warning take this advice for what it's worth a lot of times with with consoles not just playstations once you keep them like this upright for a while i don't know what it does to the i don't know if it's the the laser the disc reader or the disc drive itself or what but if you try to go back this way it doesn't always work properly I, Again, I don't understand why. I don't know the science behind it, but that's just the thing that I've experienced, especially with PlayStation 2s. Usually, if you're like this, you got to continue to keep it like this. So I'm going to do mine like that because, well, that's how I roll. This thing is heavy. This thing is very heavy. Anyhow, that's what you get in your PlayStation uh, 
box. So uh, I'm gonna hook this thing up and and uh, I'm gonna start enjoying it. Thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it.